Enough! You want Asgard? It's yours. Whatever game you're playing, it won't work. You can't defeat me. No, I know. <sighs> but he can. No! Ere wa kyojin ni heishin shita. Ningen wa kyojin ni nareru. Totsuden arabarete totsuden kiyeru. Chou ougata kyojin no shoutai. How's it going everybody? My name is Swanee and welcome back to another video. Guys, the last episode left us off with Reiner getting absolutely obliterated with Thunder Spears. Honestly, the only way he could have lived through that is if he did that consciousness thing. Other than that, he's a thousand percent dead. Because I'm doing these three episodes in one session, you guys haven't given me, which I'm sure there's an explanation for, the whole consciousness thing. I mean, that explains how Bert was able to survive the first neck shot for Mikasa. But that's where the last episode left us off with, with Reiner getting blasted with Thunder Spears. Also, we got introduced to a quadruped intelligent titan, which is really interesting yeah it was carrying luggage and it, it, it looked like it was carrying boxes or crates with a couple of barrels Erwin came to the realization that he's been extremely selfish he's been lying to everyone he's been fooling them and all for his dream and at least he's aware of that at least he realizes that fortunately this dream is on course for you know the, a positive direction for humanity he said even if the plan fails he's still he's still wanting to go to the basement which i don't blame him i mean his entire life dream and his dad's life dream was all about the basement bert is still nowhere to be found which is a little worrying because again they made the note in the last episode that when aaron won he beat the, the armored titan bert came out of nowhere right fell down we're still gonna have to be on the lookout for bert because he's still nowhere to be found and the colossal titan is no joke so as far as notes go that's kind of it for me i kind of quickly recap that that. I wanted to at least run through everything so I don't have any other notes for the recap and that's kind of it I kind of addressed all the major points and to be honest I really want to jump into this next episode so without further ado let's get right into it this was such an epic scene bro the um the weight difference between Aaron and the boulder that statistic you guys hit me with crazy いざとなったら俺の巨人で何とかするしかなさそうだ。でも作戦が成功したらせっかく。This is Reiner and Bert's perspective. Oh my god. 俺の巨人って何だよ、ライナー。せっかく開けた穴って言ったのか。ベルトルト。マーコ。Wrong place, wrong time, dude. Wow. Wow, Marco put that together real quick. Yeah. Bro, this is so... お前と、お前の帰りを待つ親父が汚れた民族と違うって言うんなら今すぐ証明しろ。何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何？何
Oh. Oh, and that's for. Wow. So Marco was just wrong place, wrong time. Wow, so Erwin is right. And it can talk like it can talk like the beast titan. Dude, Erwin is so big brain, it's not even funny. Interesting, okay. あ、あとはお前でもな。いいスプラッシング。そして、クリス。いや、ライナー。あ、ネマ。セライナーズインドクリスタ、バット。アイミンブロヒストリア。ウェアアンドライナーズ。あ、ネマ。セライナーズインド
Aaron and everyone to die. And they can't unleash the Thunder Spears because Armin's right there. Damn. Wow. Bert, why? <laughs> wow! Holy shit, dude! Bert's reflexes, man. They've improved since the last time Mikasa went for his neck. Yeah, he's changed. Yeah, completely different person. Oh, Armin bought too much time. What? A mushroom cloud? Oh, oh my god. Hanji. Bro, no. Bro, it's like a... It was like a nuke. A mushroom cloud? Oh my god. And Hanji's... Oh, that's true. Oh, yeah. Bro, how? Oh, my God. Bro, the landscape around Bert's feet. Ugh! I, I don't want to believe that she's dead, just because. No way she gets caught in an explosion and dies, right? Like that's like that's that's cheap. Like that is so cheap. And for it to be what a nuke from Bert, like I don't know. Miss me with that. I don't. Bro, I don't, I don't like that at all. Reiner talking about, you know, this filthy race and like, why do you like this race? I'm, I'm a little confused because are they not all the same race, right? Unless he's talking about Titan shifters and non-Titan shifters. I swear in a matter of seconds, it just, it just turned on us. I mean, I don't know how she makes out of that alive. Um, 
she was almost under the blast. She saw Bert transform right on top. And he, he fucking nuked the entire platform. Like, under his feet was just nothing. Just all gray. Just erased. This episode is a little frustrating. And now we get to see how Marco actually ended up dying. I'm actually a little worried that Hanji's dead. Just because they started off the episode with Marco being at the wrong place at the wrong time. And Reiner and Bert killing him, basically. And Annie. And now Hanji's at the wrong place at the wrong time under Bert. And I just have that, like, sick feeling in my stomach. Especially because I... I can't watch the next episode for a few more days just because I have to edit these and get them out. Aaron can't 1v1 the Colossal. Thunder Spears probably aren't gonna do shit either. I mean, it's just, it just nuked. In a matter of one or two episodes, they have an extra intelligent Titan. Bert can nuke. Reiner can transfer his consciousness through his body. I don't know. I, this, this, this episode was extremely frustrating. Um, loved it. I thought it was super hype. Don't love the ending. I'm just worried, bro. I'm just putting that two and two together with Marco being at the wrong place at the wrong time and Hanji being at the wrong place at the wrong time. Like, this is probably the worst episode to stop on just because not only do I feel down, but I'm gonna have to go through the next few days of just like knowing that, you know, they've got the upper side. And yeah, I don't have any other notes for you guys. Uh, if you guys want the full reaction, it'll be on Patreon. I also have a Discord. Both of those links will be in the description below. If you guys enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. It'd be greatly appreciated. All right, hope y'all all have a good one.